Okay, so this is just an old canvas that I've prepped. Um, I'm reusing it. It was a self-portrait, but now it's um, I've regessoed it. So now I'm gonna start. It's the same size as the deer, but um, it's 11 by 14. You can use any size you want. You can use some paper, but this is a um, gallery um, gallery series from Michael's um, canvases. So I'm going to do about the same uh, ratio onto this painting. So it's going to be a little bit larger than my sketch, but it's going to be placed on the canvas about the same way. So I'm going to start um, the same thing, this ear, um, this curve right here is the front of the face, and it goes down at an angle. Actually, that's my curve isn't quite right. You want to use your reference as best as you can, but also now I'm just going for my sketch. I'm not even using my reference photo anymore. Um, and feel free to use your eraser on your canvas as well. And as we did with the deer, um, we're just drawing it on there. I did the reverse in the first deer, but now you can do that as well with this if it helps you, if you don't feel confident in um, sketching it again, if your sketch is just so brilliant and you cannot fathom having to do it again, which I totally get, believe me. It's looking more like a kangaroo. What I'm seeing is that this part of the face looks a little bit too long. So I'm gonna go a little bit shorter and do about there. And as you can see, no one is above making state mistakes. Um, everyone is capable of art, but everyone is capable of making mistakes as well. Even the, the best and brightest have had their own share of mistakes. So don't ever feel bad in having made a mistake. but hopefully you already knew that. Okay, so just to see if I'm liking the scale of my face, I'm gonna go ahead and put my eye in, and that will really help me determine whether or not it looks accurate. I think it looks a little bit better now. Now I'll get my nose in there and put a rough line for this mouth area. Now the chest goes about like that. This is a very sporty bunny. It has very um, long features as opposed to the Reference photo is kind of more um, stocky, but I also wanted to f fill this um, canvas in a similar way than I did the deer. So see how I've done the same thing. I've kind of taken this back line, gone about the middle and diagonally from that, um, from that back to do this hind leg. And I'm just going to do a little line there to indicate. And then this is all going to be filled in with grass, so I'm not going to worry about that too much. And that's our bunny. I might just add, there's no um, visual for it in our, in our reference photo. I'm just going to add a little bunny tail. If you want to add stars or whatever, you can add anything. It's your painting. So... 
if you want to put whiskers on here that's fine too there's no whiskers visible on the image but you can make it your own in any way that you see fit and even though in the painting portion of this I will have included colors you can feel free to improvise and use whatever colors that you have on hand and enjoy much love